What's up, guys? I uh, hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. Uh, I know it's been a little bit since I posted a full video. I tried to get in some little quick tips here and there. But uh, it's Christmas, and I'm all out of swaddling clothes and wrapping paper, so I thought I'd wrap some stuff in bacon, if that's all right with y'all. Uh, just going to do a little simple bacon weave right here. If you haven't seen this, this is the way to wrap stuff in bacon. Um, lay down five pieces of bacon just like this. Lay another piece on that. Flip those little ears back. And then take the pieces you didn't have folded down. Fold them back. Stick another piece in. Lay those down and continue all the way to the end. Alright, there you go. It's just uh, five this way, six that way, and it makes like a lot more bacon than just wrapping it around. And uh, it's way better. It stays together better this way. Anyway, we'll get to what we're going to put in the middle now. Alright, so uh, we're going to do a meatloaf. Uh, it's pretty simple. I'm not even putting any vegetables or anything in there. This is literally just one pound of uh, ground beef. It's actually deer, but still. Um, one egg goes in there. And then I've got just a hamburger bun that I ran through the food processor doohickey and crumbled up and made some breadcrumbs. And I went ahead and put some garlic and onion powder in with that so it's all mixed, probably a quarter, te uh, quarter teaspoon of each. And uh, I'm going to put a little splash of Worcestershire or however you pronounce it. And then a few tablespoons of barbecue sauce. Um, I like barbecue sauce instead of ketchup because barbecue sauce is better than ketchup. So put a pretty good bit of that in there. And then I'm just going to mix that up with my hands and we'll put it over on the bacon. All right, so I got all that mixed up uh, just with my hands because that's how you do it. And I'm just going to put that right in this bacon weave. And we'll spread that out pretty thin and like I said I didn't put any vegetables in there you put onions or mushrooms or whatever you want to put in there I'm just keeping it simple uh, you can add this if you want to no problem at all but we'll get that spread out uh, a half inch thick maybe a little less if you can um, and then I'm going to uh, dump some cheddar cheese in the middle and it'll kind of wind up being like a pinwheel um, I'm also going to dump a little cheddar cheese on the floor. Uh, anyway, so got that in there. And if you'll notice, I put saran wrap down first. If you'll do that, it'll help you start this roll. All right, so we've got this rolled up. Um, and like I said, that saran wrap makes it a whole lot easier than trying to grab all five pieces at once with your fingers and stuff. I'm going to put this in a glass dish. Uh, typically a meatloaf needs to bake for like an hour on 350. I'm going to bake it for 50 minutes and then I'm going to kick it over to broil and go five minutes and then I'm going to flip it over the meatloaf, flip it over and go another five minutes. And that'll help get this bacon crispy because if you've ever cooked anything wrapped in bacon, typically what happens is the bacon stays like this consistency and you just get like a little bit of bacon flavor on your stuff, but you'll get edible bacon this way. So we'll just transfer this. Again, that saran wrap is going to help over into this dish. And then pop this in the oven for 50 minutes. And uh, we'll come back about that time. Alright, got it out of the oven. Uh, it actually just went four minutes on either side on broil. And you can see that bacon got super crispy. Actually, a little burn on the ends there. But I uh, got that cheddar cheese line right down the middle. Meatloaf is nice and juicy, steamy. I should have waited just a little bit to cut, cut it, but we're kind of crunched for time right now. But anyway, super easy. You can wrap anything in bacon just like this. Hey, baby girl. Um, but... I was just showing you, you can do meatloaf, you can do tenderloin or whatever, you know, vegan stuff. You can wrap it in bacon and then throw the bacon away, I guess, because it's vegan. Anyway, um, bacon weave for the win, you know, hashtag that. 